Hey YouTube, Lawrence from LL Bushcraft here. Now it's been a while, but I'm back out. I haven't been out for a while. I have been doing bits and pieces, I've just not been recording it. But yeah, hopefully, should be back to it. So I'm just going for a bit of a walk today, just to check out a spot I've been looking at, which is just in that little woods behind me but yeah hopefully get doing a bit bring you back when I get there hi YouTube Ellen Brushcraft here. I know I haven't been on for a while, but I have been getting out. I just haven't been videoing it. But uh, I've got a new job now, so I've been quite busy. But yeah, hopefully I'm going to get out a little bit more. And uh, when I do, I'll bring you along. All right, I'll catch up with you in a bit when I find can. Just out to show you is this guys. This is the walk down. So this is where I'm planning on. So this water line goes all the way down past where I want to camp. And as you can see, it's quite hasn't dried up like most things at the minute. It is a little bit um, sketchy in places. But yeah. Really nice little bit of, it's a copse this, it's not that old so, but um, some little spots that are ideal for doing what we all love. But yeah, just brought water with me today, I haven't even brought anything to eat, I just thought I'd get out just for a day and uh, hopefully start getting out a bit more. There's fish in this as well. I don't know whether, as you can see, there's a bit of wood. It looks still, but it's not. At the other end, you can see. Okay. I'll get back to you. Yeah, so as you can see, guys, it is running. It's not just still water. So hopefully, I'll be able to filter some of this and just use this for a water source. I know there's a bit of a dam there, but yeah. Not too wide. Yeah, you know. Tell me what you think. Yeah, it is a lovely walk down to these little bit of woodlands. Right around, it's just fields. Look, you aren't going dizzy. Yeah. yeah, so like I say, wanted to get back out. Just recording this on my phone today, so I hope it's not too bad. Yeah, be missing it. Like I said, got myself a new job. So some of you might know I used to work in a shop. Complete nightmare. Never do it again. Done it for 10 years. So now, or for the last two and a half years, I'm actually a porter in a hospital. So as you can imagine, I've been quite busy. But yeah, enjoying it, still liking it. It's going to be giving me a bit more time to do things like this because of the shift pattern. So yeah, I'm back out. I'll catch up with you in a bit. And this little camp that I found. Speak soon, guys. Yeah, so in this little coppice, it's mainly hazel. There's some birch. Um, I believe there's a few oak further down. But yeah, as you can see, it's only young in this area. 
but as you get further down it gets a little bit more established so this is the path through there's a few paths around here and there's a few dog walkers but hopefully it's Sunday now so I'm hoping not to get bothered too much yeah anyway like I said before get back to you when I get set up okay bye guys yep so I think I found my spot guys I've got a couple of trees here looks all right I'll give you a quick look around See what you think. Okay. So as you can see, it's only a little coppice area. It's quite enclosed this bit. So I just thought between these two silver birch over here. Yeah, hopefully. I'll be alright. Bring you back when we've got the hammock set up. Yeah, so that's the Decathlon Solenock Hammock, guys. I know a lot of people have already shown this, but it's the first time I've used mine. So, yeah. Tell me what you think of uh, cheaper brands like Solenock. Some nice little areas through here. Just a bit there. See where you can see the down tree? That's quite shaded in there, and that's quite a good possibility for some time, a stealthy one. This isn't a permission, so this is public land. As you can see, I just brought my uh, gas mask bag today with what I've got with me, which is just the tarp and the hammock and the straps. But yeah, peaceful today. Hey guys, loving this, absolutely loving it. Just been relaxing in the hammock. Hammock's lovely by the way. It's just what I need. Yeah, so like I say, at some point this week, I'm going to come out and do an overnight here. It's just been so peaceful. Only thing is, you get the odd little biplane going over so i'll have to be careful when i'm recording other than that it's pretty good all right guys i'll bring you back in a bit all right guys so that's where i was hanging as you can see we'll leave no trace as usual and just on cue, one of them planes I was telling you about. So I'm just gonna have a slow walk out. If I see anything interesting, I'll bring you back. Yeah, so that's that little area I could see, guys. As you can see, that tree's down. And this is right the way around it. Which is a bit dark in here, like. But yeah, just through the other side, there's just a lot of bracken, clearing, a few bigger trees. Yeah, nice big old rock there, look. Yeah. Found some lovely little spots today. Yeah, so like I said, I found some lovely little spots today while I've been out. This bit here, where I'm in, is a, a bit with a down tree. To be quite honest, it's not much good for my hammock. But if I decide to ground dwell, it's spot on. I could disappear here so simple. And I love it. 
Anyway, guys, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to head off home. I'll speak to you again soon. I'll look after yourselves. Ellen Bushcraft, signing out. Bye now.